26 degrees Fahrenheit. I think that's about negative three Celsius. Somewhere in Michigan where the farmlands turn to the north woods. I hope you can hear me okay. <coughs> this is gonna be a video of you just walking with me because I don't know what else to film today. Um, there's a downed cow out in the field that I'm gonna walk out there and try to push her back up to the barn. If I let her sit out there for too long, I don't think she's gonna come up on her own. She's got a hurt foot. It's 9 a.m. I'm supposed to be milking cows right now and I'm running a little bit late. I'm trying to get them in the barn, but I can't just leave this lady out here. I'm gonna bring her up, depending on how she looks when I get her up here. I might milk her. I might lay her down, like for a nap. Not a permanent dirt nap, just to, to rest her leg. All right, here we go. Might be a little hard to tell on your end, but we're gonna be going downhill right now. The poop is frozen. Still got a little bit of the other day's snow left over. Barely got a dust in. My boots are gonna be kind of squeaking too, gosh dang it. Later today, when I'm not here, got some time to myself, I was going to finish piecing together some scenes I took a couple days ago. I just needed to get out of the house, so I went into a kind of big town. I did... Ooh! Oh, no! Oh, is it still... Re oh, it's still going. Sorry about that. Okay, so it's really not a big town, but it has a Walgreens. I did some shopping at Walgreens. I got a burger at Burger King. And then I filmed a little bit of the back roads on the way home. Someone gave me the idea to maybe put it up as a premiere. And then I can watch it with you guys in a chat. And well, if I had, if I had known that, I would have filmed it maybe a little bit differently. So I'm thinking about doing that today. Finishing that video. Up, 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 up. Oh, the red paint means that she recently had mastitis, but she was treated and she's better now. And I don't know what she did to her foot here. This is plastic. I could beat her ass with it as hard as I can, and it still wouldn't hurt her. Up, 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 up. I've never tried. Usually you don't have to do much more than this to get it moving. Hey, hey, hey! Hop, hop, hop! Hop, up, 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 up. You want to eat that? That's kind of nasty. There's better hay up there. <sighs> Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Another thing I'm going to do today is buy a gimbal. I'm trying to hold it steady for you. And then another thing I was thinking about doing today was just maybe starting somewhere out here in the field and going up to the barnyard and walking through it all. Hop, 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 hop. Show you scenes of that. Like a behind the scenes look. 
my stage hop up 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 show a lot of myself in the pit so far up 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 bringing the cows down into the barn feeding calves in their little trailer park of hutches hop 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 hey hey Sorry, I should have warned you before I get hollering like that. And then I thought, oh, well, maybe if I do a little tour of the barnyard, I wonder if that would be better to post as a premiere. And then you can rewatch it again later after that if you don't want to, like, see my myself in the chat or type or read messages. You can just watch it as a little tour video. Or maybe I'll just post it as a tour video. Hop, up, 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 up. Hey, 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 hey. Hop, up, 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 up. Oh, Polly, you're so mean. Should have just let her sit out there where she had that little bit of hay and could rest her leg. For all I know, she's been out there all night long. Hop, up, 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 up. Probably has. The cold won't bother her. They actually do better in cold weather like this rather than extreme heat. Like the summers can get really hot, really humid here. Hop, up, 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 up. But when it gets below zero, we got to take a couple extra precautions with the herd. Because they can get pneumonia if they could just get suddenly drastically, like, negative five Fahrenheit. I seen it. Hop, 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 hop. She gets up here, she can get water. Good hay. They were already fed grain, the whole herd. Bup, 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 bup. But it wasn't me. That was before I got here this morning. Somebody else came out with a four wheeler and wagon. Hop, 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 hop. And put grain in their troughs. And looks like they didn't try to get her up or. Maybe they did and she refused. She didn't want to listen to them. Hop, up, 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 up. So she missed out on grain. When I get the whole herd locked down into the barn where I'm going to milk them, I'll give her some extra grain. Oh, careful. She's been looked at by a professional. I'm not a professional anything. I just milk the cows, feed their babies. In the past, I focused a little bit more on field work, but right now, I'm the milkmaid. I can't remember what they said they did to treat her foot. They did something. Up, 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 up. Like, they examined it because we had a bull that was limping like that one time. We brought him into the barn, and he had like a four-inch screw stuck into his hoof. Took it out, gave him an antibiotic, wrapped it up, and he was all right. Wanted to make sure that's not the case with this lady. Looks like just a sprain. Come on, up, 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 up. One of the barns up here is called the stall barn. That's which that green one straight ahead, the short green one straight ahead. And there's beds with sand in there. Up, 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 up. I'm gonna put her up here by the um, food and water. So I'm thinking about like five different things at once right now. Come on, let's go. Keep her moving. Okay, you know what? That's good enough.
<laughs> Did I tell you in this video I wanted to film it in one shot? And then not do any editing. Just to show you one little moment in my memoir. Boop, 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 boop. It's something I don't have to fiddle with. Cutting and piecing together and editing for days. You want to see my real life? Here's a, here's a paragraph of a page. Why am I still pushing you? You, uh, no water in there. It's part of the grain troughs. Hey, calm down. Who are you again? You gotta get milked. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Up, 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 up. She had something happen with her back legs after she had her baby. They, she just had really weak hips. And it helped her if she, uh, Hoop. So she fell down real hard after she had her baby and she cut her foot and been treating that. And then if you put those shackles on her, it helps her legs stay together. And she's been doing a lot better since she had those on her, kind of training her legs back into where they need to be. That's really uncommon to see that here. You'll probably never see it again in my vlogs, hopefully. But once you get more than a few cows, odds are there's always going to be something wrong with somebody. <laughs> Sometimes this place looks like the apocalypse already hit it. My zombie cows. Hop, up, 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 up. I've already got some of the herd in the barn here. You know, you're close enough. I'm not good at walking and talking at the same time, y'all. Can't stay focused on what I'm supposed to be doing. Squeaky, 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 up the hill. <laughs> oh, and she's young. She's a heifer. We still call them that after they have their first baby. She's technically a cow now. When I say heifer, I just mean that like she either hasn't been bred or she just had her baby for the first time. So she's still trying to figure out how to fit in around here. She just kind of wanders around like, okay, what are we doing now? Everybody else in here, they know the drill. Breaky, breaky. Shake and bakey. Up, 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 up. Ooh. How deep is that? Looks kind of deep. <laughs> We're going to try to walk this tightrope here. Up, 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 up. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. Up you go. Come on. Hey, she had a baby yesterday. I think she's the she's the one. Up, 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 up. So she might be a little slow. Yeah, there's a new baby in the barn. But maybe I'll give like a quick two-second shot of that in the end. 
This is woohoo. About bringing down the cow and bringing up the cows. Up, 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 up. two aisles in here. It's going to take forever. Are you getting the point yet? Do I need to film this entire process of getting these cows out? It's not a tutorial by any means. And I could film the entire next 10 minutes getting all these ladies out of here just so you can feel my pain. Even with my special gloves, my hands are freezing. See how much longer it takes to get everybody pushed up to the barn. Up, 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 up. I get walking and talking. I just lose all concept of time. Since we started out with going after that hurt foot mama, I mean, it could have been 10 minutes or 25 minutes. I couldn't tell you. depending on how long these ladies want to fart around. I might just say bye, 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 bye right now. And I'll see you soon. <laughs> hey, 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 Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was going to warn you about that. Wakey, wakey. Up, 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 up. Green paint. She just recently had a baby. Hop, up, 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 up. It's a little bit of afterbirth right there. Somebody dropped off two full grown roosters here last month. I can't believe they're still alive. They're really good friends though. They don't fight each other. They're like bros. And they live in this barn. I haven't seen them yet today. Come on. Up, 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 up. You can poop and walk at the same time. I know you can't pee and walk, but keep her moving.
Another drinking fountain. Hop, hop, hop. Another green trough. You didn't see my last video. There was a minute of me milking cows in it. In that barn right there. Boop, 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 boop. I got a busy day. I don't have time for that today. So to show you. dogs. I've got eight dogs. At least two of them are supposed to be helping me right now. I have eight Australian Shepherd cattle dogs. Some are retired, some are currently working, some are in training. They've all got different jobs to do. That's why I have eight Come on! We almost got it. There you have it. I'm ready to milk cows. There's a holding pen at the end of this. And it's like a big room before they come in to the barn. This. <laughs> See, they're all right outside there right now. And then there's the holding pen. And then I can milk 12 at a time. Here's my stick. I'm always losing this thing. Okay. See you later, friends. Oh, I forgot. I was going to show you. In my last vlog, it ended kind of sad with one of the two newest calves not making it. But the good news is we've still got the one, but he got diarrhea, even though he's eating good out of a bottle. So I get to clean that after I'm done milking cows, feeding cows, and get him cleaned up. <laughs> You're looking so much better than last night. We found you in the field. You've rolled off your bed. And uh, that happens throughout the day. So, I'll get you cleaned up too. That's all for now, folks. Watch out for deer on your way out.